After a popular request, today I'm gonna make a drop from scratch and take you through the process. I have no idea how this is gonna turn out, but if you don't wanna hear a preview of whatever it is I'm gonna make today, skip a few seconds and here it is, a preview of what I'm about to make. As always, one of the first 500 comedies will win a free masking done by me. Make sure to follow me on Instagram if you're alive, but I'll shut up now. Let's dive into it. I'm gonna start off with my favorite tempo, 126. I'll put in some of my samples here. Let's find a kick. Today I'm feeling like this drier sound kick. I want it to sound a bit different because that's gonna lead to different results. So let's boost it with some tape warm thingy. It sounds fatter, but I still want some more click to it maybe. Let's start off with adding another layer to see how that goes. Let's add the top kick from my sample pack from Meet You. Let's try and put it in the same mixer channel and see what happens. I actually like that sound. It compressed them both together in a way. Now we have a kick that I like. It probably sounds like I'm making too much of an importance of this, but just slight adjustments like this will, I don't know why, but it just inspires me to make stuff sound different if it's just a little bit different. I'm adding a clap. I want something bigger as well, so let's layer it with like a pre-shifted snare or something. I'm gonna put a little white noise into the kick here. You can barely hear it, but it adds some punch. Let's get some groove going. Maybe find a bass sound. I like this sound, it's a bit clean. A is way too high, I think. G Let's try something. It's a bit too low. It's pretty cool. When I don't have any idea of what I'm about to make, I just like to start off with a groove and foundation. So I got the drums down and now. I can start playing around with the rhythm. Maybe we can have it on everyone like this. Let's add something to give it some more depth. Maybe like a short kick on top of that. I'm just adding some shaker here, just to groove it into this one maybe. I like that. Okay, I'm gonna add some. Some more stuff. Just to help with the groove. Because the better the groove, the better the song. This is probably gonna be boring for some of you guys to watch, but I'm just trying to show you guys as detailed as possible what I'm thinking and so forth. So it's still, I'm just trying to get the groove down. Because I have no idea what I'm gonna make. I want a long open hi hat maybe. Something like that in here. It can help to pitch the hi-hats in what you feel is the right key as well. It's not entirely correct, but it works for now. Ooh, that's cool. It's a bit more unique, which I like, so let's keep that one. Add it here as well. Okay, now I want some wobbles in here, so Mr. Bill has this Neuro Bass preset sample pack. Lots of great stuff, let's pitch it a bit down. Let's get some gnarliness in here. I like that. I use another one, this, and do the same thing. Just see where it fits and sits. Just trying to find out which hits I like. Which I can use, which I can't. Just trying to make it fit. Okay, so I like this groove that we're going here. Let's save the project. And I'm using this from Matroda's sample pack. It's like a bass thingy. I don't know if it's gonna fit in the end, but I like that feel a lot. This feels wrong in the wrong key. Okay, let's find a subline or like a bass groove to complement what we already have because it's a pretty interesting rhythm. So let's see if we can complement that with some bass. I'm gonna use the same sub that I always use. I love it so much, punch it in the balls. Let's have some more release here and... Okay, so I'm just gonna experiment really because now we have... It's not a lot to go with, so... So 
some side chain on it will help a lot, I think. I kind of like this. And then a bit of a break maybe, and then back in. It's a bit slow rhythm, but it's, in, it's a bit unique, I think. Not unique at all, but you get what I'm saying, it's a bit weird. Could work, let's hear it down an octave. That's really dark, but I think that's cool-ish. I'm not sure. My neighbors are gonna get a bit pissy, but let's try and use D sharp here. <laughs> Oof, I like it actually. Maybe we could like go up. Bum bottom, bum bottom. Turn. So G. And now I'm just removing the base of all the unnecessary stuff that I added. And I put them in different channels for God knows what reason. And this has to go up three as well, I guess. Or does it go up three? No. One, two, three, yeah, three. And then two. Ma, ma. It's a bit a bit more spicy melodic melodically. Maybe we can have chords at the start like Let's try and do that. I think I want to try spire today. I'm feeling inspired. You can now dislike the video, it's fine. I don't use Spyro a lot, but I use it when I want like saw stuff because Brooks sent me some stuff a long time ago that I still use. I still love them. Let's find some chords. And a shorter one here and then two. Could be cool. It's what I have in my head. It might sound very bad. We'll see. What's happening? Why is it switching? Oh, it's probably not enough voices on this sound. Let's switch sound then. That's okay. Let's uh, double it up with some another sound. Maybe we should. I like that. I want a thicker layer in the middle. I'm just gonna use like a pretty standard serum thingy. I think this needs to be heavier in some sense. Probably like a short reverb, maybe. Sounds pretty massive. Okay, we're starting to get a foundation. I hope I'm not boring you guys. I'm a bit slow. Let's use FL keys. <laughs> Could be cool with like some piano chops. I did like a hundred tips and I, well, that was one of my tips to use a piano chord and I remember that. I remember my own tips. Maybe it works, maybe it doesn't. No release. You could use like an OTT sound. No lows. It would just be like... We cut it actually in volume. I 
think that would be cool to stop it just before the next part. Because then you get sort of a stoppy she feel. Could be interesting to stop it in between here as well. I like that. I like that. I'm very, very tired. <laughs> if you haven't noticed, I'm sorry. All right, let's keep this in the middle. And then we zero spread this. Sound a bit cheap. So I'm gonna put an SSL on it and hope that helps. That actually helped a bit, it made it a bit cooler. Magnetic maybe. Okay, nice. I'm gonna bounce this out. Make some reverses here, I think. Okay. Side chain it a bit. Okay, let's add some white noise. I think that should work. You can download all of these samples for free below. Okay, so we have a white noise. I actually don't think it sounds too bad. I want some crisp in the bass. Let's add some bit crushing. was perfect, nice. Lucky. Okay, so now you're gonna see me make a melody. Just gonna find some sound that I like. I like this sound. Not really feeling it. I like starting on the beats a bit more dissonant because this is A sharp. Which has a lot more energy. And then some short notes. That's probably lame. That was horrible. Let's try again. Okay, I think that's something. And the second part here, I wanted to switch up, not that much. Mm. Now you kind of have that note in between here. Because you want the melody to be. 
If we skip this, it's a bit more interesting because we have the piano doing that note. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. I actually forgot it was not a live stream. <laughs> Let me know what you guys think in the comments then. that just a low note instead I want a pluck cuz I feel like it's a bit more of a plucky melody I might be wrong but I want to try my favorite pluck and use the channel bus that Brooks and I made for our song Right, they can check the making of here. I think that's a bit cool, I like that. I want more piano, louder. Oh, this is too much, I don't like the sound of that. Maybe just... It's too resonant. Maybe just like this, and then with some distortion. You know what? I want the magnetic sound here, I think. Just has its own sound. I really love it. It's more like it. Let's soothe it out as well, though. Then... So this is gonna sound horrible on its own, but in the mix... It sounds pretty massive. I like it. I actually just remembered, I have... I have a lead that I made a long time ago. So what I usually do is I sample out when I make something I like. And I made this in Serum a while ago. Let me play it for you. You can check out the making of here. I made it for the Ritual Remix, I think. And uh, I sample it out. And I think if I put this in Slice X, which I just did, I can use that lead. I'm not sure. Let's try it. Okay, so I just slapped on some effects and it sounds like this. Just some reverb, really. Okay, so in Slice X, I have to pitch it like this. Okay, so I have this now. Amazing. But I like this first note because it's like, gives it, and then, should be. Okay, it's not gonna be accurate. But I think that's gonna be really cool actually. With the pluck. Yeah, it's gonna be dope, I think. Okay, so I'm just gonna spend some time now to fill in this. It's just doing what I've done. Okay, so I got the MIDI sorted down. It sounds a bit false, but. Okay, it's really false. But it, it was the best I could do in such a short amount of time. Okay, I'm really curious if this is gonna work. Let's hear it. Okay, we need some reverb, that's for sure. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna follow the notes. Actually, gonna automate both of these and just play around with it for a little while. Okay, I think uh, sounds okay.
<laughs> okay, let's add hi-hats in the second part here. Guys, I'm just adjusting stuff, making it sound a little bit less bad. It's a little bit too much reverb. Guys, I'm making a shady build-up thingy. I feel like it was a bit too messy, so I'm gonna just make this side chain go a bit smoother. And I want some distortion on this. Okay, that sounds pretty cool. Let's see how much time we've spent. An hour and 15 minutes. I need a coffee soon. Let's fit it to tempo, 124. Okay, let's do a quick fill here. This as well. This just needs more, more spice. Running out of time. It's in D, so it's one up. And some white noise maybe. Have like a little impact or something. Super lame, but let's go. Maybe like this. G, F sharp, F, E, D sharp, four down. Okay, that was a very rushed build up, but let's listen to the final result. I'm a bit tired, I haven't slept, so I don't even know how that sounds, but <laughs> I tried to make something from scratch. I hope it was valuable or fun or something. I'm, I'm gonna go sleep now, but <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed watching regardless. And I'm probably gonna either love or hate this tomorrow. I don't know if you guys know that feeling, but let's see how I feel about it when I wake up. I'll let you guys know, and I hope you have an amazing day. Bye.